Damas y caballeros, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another Pomade Review. I'm your host, Joe J. Jr., and today I thought I'd take things a little bit more to the old school, but not too far back, not too close to the present. Of course, I'm talking about Three Flowers Tres Flores Pomade. Now, this pomade has been in my household for a long time. Not used by me, but by someone else in my household. And I think it smells good. It's definitely a good smelling product. You know, I think I've only ever used this once and that was like five years ago when I had no other product left to use. So, you know, for me, this product's just, I don't really remember too much about it. That's why I decided to make today's pomade review. But this other person in my household that uses it, you know, if you give them this pomade, they'll honestly be, they're, <laughs> they'll honestly be like this. <laughs> No joke, that would honestly be them. <laughs> so, let's get this thing started, okay? So, we're gonna unscrew it, and you know, you can already see that it's primarily water-based. You know, I don't even gotta put this up to my nose. I can already smell it from right here. But the thing that I like so much about this pomade though, is like certain pomades either smell really bad, or they have like an overwhelming strong scent. But what I like so much is like, it seems like no matter how much you use this, like the scent will not change. It won't get strong, it won't get overwhelming. It just stays perfectly balanced. So I think that's enough talking and let's get to the styling. So that's a bit more than what I got. So what's really cool though, is also like this, this stuff just glides through. It's got a really good consistency just stays on your finger and you know we got to emulsify the product remember this guys for all you gentlemen out there who want to improve your style with any pomade you got to emulsify it you got to warm up the product so it glides through your hair very smoothly so start applying it to my hair you know don't be picking at it you know if you're a guy and you're applying a pomade or you're just a girl with short hair that wants to apply some pomade you know you got to get that stuff all throughout your hair and because I have longer hair you know, pomades seem to glide more smoothly for me. So I'm gonna get a little bit more, not too much more. And emulsify it a little bit. Get that through there. Make sure I get the back ends. So, so far it seems to be flattening my hair pretty well. You know, I know people like to get some volume with their hair, but for me, I like to go for more classic aesthetics like this. Cause I feel like people go for so many modern looks nowadays that like you can't just neglect the classics like come on they got a history behind them just about every modern look nowadays is some sort of variation of an old classic look like you know how they have the slick backs they have the modern slick backs the messier slick backs so it's time to get combing so already I'm combing my hair. Guys, this goes through like smoother than Suavecito. I might make this my main product. Okay, it's going. So far, so good. You know, there's no tugging, there's no pulling at all. You know, it's very smooth. Got a nice shine to it. Now, if you guys wanna shine, you know, I definitely recommend this product for you, but me, I'm a person that likes to have sh some shine, and I know some people like to go for more natural look, with more matte and like clays and stuff like that, but not me. I like a little bit of shine to my hair. Right now, I'm gonna let it settle down a bit, see how well it goes, see if it really holds up and lives up to its expectations, all right? So, I'll let you guys know exactly what I think about it when I get back. Okay, guys, so, it's been about 20 minutes so far since I've combed my hair. As you guys can see, it's got a nice shine to it. You know, managed to keep the hairs mostly weighed down. Cause my biggest concern has always been with every pomade is the back. Cause no matter what I do to comb it, it just seems like any pomade I use just holds the curls in place, but I don't want it to hold the curls in place. So far, what I'm liking is that this product's actually managing to keep my hair flat. It's staying slick. And what I've noticed is like, from all its shininess and everything, you know, you can recomb it. This isn't like a product that like once it dries up, it's game over. 
you're stuck with it. Now this one you can like comb all throughout the day and you know I'm really liking the fact that it keeps my curls like way down to like more of a straight sort of look. So I think it's time to stop looking and just really acknowledge the strengths here. So it got into my hair very smoothly. I will not deny that. You know, the smell is really pleasant. Like, people might knock it down because it's like too strong of a scent, but I feel like the scent is pretty good um, so far. Very easy to get out of the, out of the jar because I know with clays and certain like matte products, you know, sometimes it's like really hard to get stuff out. But this went out like really smooth, really just quick and easy out of there. So. If I was to rate this, you know, a 9 out of 10. Now, I know, I know, maybe I'm giving it too high of a score, but so far, like I said, it's been years since I've used this. I And I only used it once ever. But so far, I'm liking it. Who knows? I might just make this my own product as well. So, that other person in my household better watch out. Because I might end up just taking theirs. Anyways, guys. If you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to drop me one of these, of course. Be sure to like and subscribe. You know, check out some of my other videos, because, you know, why not? Um, definitely watch the previous video if you haven't seen that one. Definitely recommend checking that one out. And if you guys want to see any specific pomades for me to try out, definitely leave that down in the comments below. Anyways, I hope you guys have an amazing day because you guys are all amazing people. And if you guys want to make my day more amazing, please be sure to share this video with some of your friends. Comment down below on some other things you guys would like to see. And as always, you know, I'm Joe J Jr. And I'm out.